time to wake up. This is what you need. Entertaining and educating. It's Kenny Klein TV. Yeah, yeah. First Amendment. Gotta respect it. Come tune in to see how we keep an eye on police and government agencies. Yeah, all this misinformation. That's a problem we gotta solve. Give credit and praising those who do an amazing job. Tune in. Please don't delay. Entertaining while we educate. This is what you need. Hey, Kenny Klein TV. Let's go. What is up, guys? Hope everyone is having a great day. If you're new to the channel, welcome. And if you're coming back, welcome back. And if you have yet to subscribe, please go ahead and do that. Before we get started today, could you guys please go ahead and smash that like button? It'll help get the channel some exposure. All right, so today we are taking out the channel, no question about it. Now, he is out there, and he is doing a decent job of doing a cop wash. There is a, um, a cop. There's a traffic stop. He's a good distance away. He's not involving himself in the situation. But then when the stop is completely finished and the cop drives off, our auditor, cop watcher friend decides to, and he goes and parks a little bit away, he decides, whoa, I don't know. I know the stop is completely done, but I'm going to go find out what this cop is doing because, you know, that's what, you know, because, because you know, who knows what that cop is doing. He could be doing anything illegal or anything, right? Uh, and he ends up getting approached by a veteran. Let's go ahead and get right into this. A bold strategy, Cotton. Let's see if it pays off for him. Bad touch! Stranger danger! I'm sorry. What you mean? Are you filming the cop because you don't think he's doing his job? I'm filming the cop for officer safety. I keep using the horn. I don't think it means what you think it means. For officer safety, are you a cop? Am I obligated? He does not need your protection. He has a damn camera on his chest. True that. True that. On this street, take your little First Amendment audit and you're off the street. Because I'm sick of the guys are trying to give them a bad rap when all they're doing is their job. So get going. 
before he needs to get out of his car and do his job for me whooping Ruh -ruh. Zoinks! Jinkies! Jeepers! For fathering this man while he's trying to protect and serve. And all you're doing is causing problems for him. Go! All this man is doing is his job. And I'm and helping you, him. No. I'm helping him do his you're job. You're not sir. helping him do his job. You're posting I'm out here, I'm out here for his safety. Job. I'm out for here his, for his safety, yeah. What, how's that your safety? He's not here on a call for you. I'm out here for his safety, though. You know, you know they always scream officer safety, right? You should know if you're a Navy veteran like myself, you should know that we have a constitutional right to do this, right? I know you have a constitutional so right. So why are you to do bothering this? me? Why are you bothering him trying to do his job? Do I do I not have a right to do it? No, he's not bothering anybody. I'm not bothering anybody either. You are. Your house. Why this man is trying to do his job and put a camera on him. Is he here doing a call on you? No. So there is no safety. How do you know that? Because this is my house. Is this this your house right here? I have cameras on both these houses. I'm watching this house while my man is out of town. So yes, I have authority over both of these properties. This man just pulled up here. You pulled up behind him. Get out camera. And you're gonna sit there and record and say, oh, it's officer safety. No, you wanna put them up on your little YouTube channel for your little girlfriends to sit there and go, when all the man is doing is his job. You're not protecting I'm, him. I'm helping him do his job, you sir. Wow, the land of make believe. You see this thing right here? I'm not gonna touch you, officer. You see this thing right here? <laughs> yeah, what is it's that? It's a camera. Oh, okay. He has one on the front and the back of his car. Okay, so, so what's the problem with one more? You don't need to record them because I'm tired of TikToks where you guys only put up half the goddamn story. I'm not sure what you're referring to, but you're, okay. Of course not. You're going to play stupid. <laughs> you have the right to remain Because you are stupid. Why, why would you? Why would you? Why would you? So I haven't done any. On the line. Every yeah, I put my life on the line to help him protect him. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? How are you protecting them? I'm out here. I'm out here. So if something happened to this protect. officer and his body. His... Yeah, that's right. I just want to make sure y'all good. I'm going to leave. Yeah, please All do. Because right. when you leave, he leaves. And then I can go inside and I appreciate <laughs> you don't hear that. Ah, you funny, bro. You oh. real funny. Dude, you don't know what funny You real is. funny, bro. I had his job in the military. How many? So there you guys go. Apparently, he was doing it for the officer safety even though he was not really doing anything he was simply parking probably writing up the report for the traffic stop he had he decided to follow him down the street and continue to film him um somebody got upset about it and you know they probably seen these videos on tiktok and on youtube and facebook and all over the place and you know uh, he there, there is something to be said about that they only post part of a story. It's it's not just uh, auditors, it's media in general, not just the left, not just the right. All of media in general does this sort of thing. They, they, they have a story that fits their narrative that they're trying to tell, right? And auditors do the same thing. Um, he was, and the police officer did a great job by leaving and trying to get the guy to leave. But the auditor, no, 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 his ego got to hold him and say, you know what? This is already a more entertaining video than it was. So I'm going to keep doing it. And he proceeds to start filming the guy's house. The cops end up coming back again. Uh, I didn't show that part because I think I'll probably show it on a live stream. It, I, I kind of wanted to... It's a little longer and it's not as entertaining, but he does end up, the cops end up coming back and, you know, um, it does get de-escalated, the situation does get de-escalated, so there's not a whole lot more, that's why I didn't really post it. Um, it, it, it just makes, it makes the guy kind of look bad, um, but I didn't, you know, just try not to do, show that part. But the cop came back, the same police officer, and handled the situation smoothly, perfectly expertly let me know what, you, what do you guys think how what did you think about the cop watcher what did you think about the veteran what did you think about the officer and how he handled the situation would you have liked to see him handle it a little differently what could he have done better 
how could this have gone a lot worse? Let me know in the comments section. All right, guys, hope you all have a fantastic rest of your day, and we will see you in another video. Peace. We've only just been.